On Friday, September 20th, in conjunction with school walkouts and student protests across the world, hundreds of Burlington High School students gathered in the school auditorium to protest the inaction of U.S. and world leaders in dealing with climate change. I spoke to some of the student organizers who started by explaining why they believe it is up to their generation to lead on the issue when many adults have failed to do so. It's pretty much because they're going to become the leaders of the next generation. So we can't just keep on looking to those above us in greater power and asking them to do something because in reality it comes down to us and what we do because our actions will dictate the future same as how the actions of the older generations dictated our future. They've caused this issue that we're fixing because we're the ones who are going to be living in it. So it's important for us to actually make the change that we want. I think it's so important because it actually is our future. Like this is where we're looking towards. The older generation won't be around for the actual fallout and for all of the negative effects that will come with it. So I think it's so important that we know where our futures are going and we have control over it. The future, we're the future, so um, basically the world is in our hands when all these older politicians are, are gone. Um, so we have to, in order for us to be able to express our opinions, we have to have a voice, we have to be heard. So what inspired them to get involved in the fight over climate change? Well, I'm very, you know, open about the environment and I totally think that we need to help improve it because it's my future and it's the school's future as students to take care of it and make sure that it's around for as long as it can be. Right now, I think it's our biggest global crisis. I think that everything that everybody has issues with now, like health care and equal rights and everything, those are obviously really important things, but I think that none of that's going to matter if we don't figure out our climate crisis right now. It's, I think it's something that needs to be um, a top priority for everybody. The students also said they were inspired by 16-year-old Swedish climate change activist Greta Thunberg, who recently arrived in the United States by boat and spoke to both members of the U.S. Congress and world leaders in the United Nations Climate Action Summit. Known for her direct approach when speaking to power, Greta has become a new leader in the fight to get climate change to be taken seriously and addressed with real action by those in power. It's so amazing. I love watching her, like all the videos she has, um, watching her in front of all of these grown, mostly men, and stating what she believes in and telling her own truth. And it is like the universal truth. Like it's climate change is real, it's going to affect us, and we need to act now. Uh, she's our age, she's close to our age, so it was really inspirational to see her you know, talking in front of thousands of people and t getting in with the Senate and the Congress and everything. Like She's really just impressive of everything that she's done. And we've watched a few of her videos, and she's really just inspirational to hear her talk about it and how passionate she is about the topic. Finally, the students behind the climate change protest at BHS said they thought it was a productive event and they were inspired by how many students joined in and they hope that their actions will help inspire others moving forward. It was really positive. Um, a, a lot, we got to have an open discussion. Um, people get to voice their opinions about it, um, their concerns about climate change. I think that was um, a really good thing that we did. Um, so it was super positive. I was so happy uh, to see the movement that's being taken place among like all of the young students of the world, they're paying attention, they're listening, and they're speaking up, and I think it's awesome that they are, and I think it's awesome that we feel like now we have a voice and that we can project that as loud as we want. But I think that our protests definitely like inspired other students to get involved in it. I think that it's something that everybody our age needs to be really um, like in touch with and knowledgeable about because it's something that's gonna affect our future and our children, so. I think that this is going to get the ball rolling for other students who could be inspired by it. It's definitely inspirational. It, I, I saw the students coming in from the doors and I can genuinely tell you that I just had a smile right away. Just to see like all these students coming in hordes and hordes coming in through this auditorium where I didn't even think there'd be that much attention but so many students were willing and ready to show how much they cared. It just, it makes me feel hopeful that a change can be made and a change will be made. At Burlington High School, I'm B News Director Rich Hosford.